So we recently talked about physical controls. Now we're gonna pivot into administrative controls. So what are administrative controls? Well, administrative controls are the policies, procedures, and guidelines that a company puts into place to manage their security. They help shape the rules that everyone follows to protect sensitive data, and ensure that security is a team sport. I always like to think of it as paper documentation that people must follow. Now let's take a look at some examples of administrative controls. A common example of administrative controls is security policies. These policies might cover rules like password strength, specifying how long passwords should be and what type of characters cases to use. Companies can also enforce policies requiring employees to lock their devices when stepping away from their desk. Now, additionally, guidelines for the IT team may include how often software must be updated across the organization. These policies ensure everyone follows best practices to maintain security standards. So next, let's talk about access control. Access control policies defines who has permission to access certain systems or information. For example, only IT staff might have administrative access to certain softwares or sensitive documentation that might be restricted to specific departments. This is often called least privileged access. This limits the exposure to unnecessary risks. Now, another key administrative control is regular cybersecurity awareness training. Keeping employees educated on cybersecurity threats like phishing or ransomware ensures that they can recognize and respond to them when they see them. Now, the more aware the team is, the better that they can defend against attacks. Now, anyone who follows this channel knows that I am a big proponent of cybersecurity awareness trainings. Um, I think that most effective trainings is where you can utilize gamification or some type of entertainment into the cybersecurity awareness training to be the most effective. There are some great platforms out there that are great for not just employees, but also individuals who want to ensure that their loved ones or their family members or their kids are properly trained in cybersecurity tactics. I'm going to list a few here, but I will put a complete list um, of ones that I like in the description below. Administrative controls provides the foundation of a strong security culture. By implementing and following administrative controls, we can ensure that our data is protected and that everyone is involved. By following these policies and guidelines, we can ensure that our data is safe and secure. Now stay tuned. Next, we talk about technical controls.